a SWAT team, a police SWAT team entered the building, and that may have been uh, what we've been seeing. They were bringing out uninjured people. You heard the man there with the local affiliate talking about the fact that people have been hiding in bathrooms, in a kitchen, and that they have apparently been evacuated. That is also what the journal is reporting as well. They are reporting in addition to that, that, that among those shot is the president of this temple. You heard Peter Ducey reporting earlier that the paper had also talked about the fact that the head priest, we don't know if that's the same individual, was holed up somewhere, locked somewhere with a cell phone and calling out saying 20 to 30 people had been injured. We've had uh, reports that children have been taken hostage or are among hostages there in the building's basement. Um, it, people do begin to arrive at this temple, gather there as early as 6.30 a.m. local time, and that there was another service that would have begun around 11 or 11.30. Um, no word on who the shooter would have been, any suspects, no specific information on the level of injuries that have been suffered there. But again, Milwaukee Sentinel Journal saying at least four people shot. Um, Peter can tell us a little bit more. I understand he's getting some word on injuries now. Peter? And Shannon, we just heard from the public information officer that near the scene who's working with the authorities there who said that two people have been transferred now to a hospital in Milwaukee, they are both males, and one of them is critical. This public information officer, PIO, would not tell us about any other injuries. We don't know if anybody else is on their way to the hospital, and we also don't know if anyone else uh, has been admitted to the hospital just yet. But we did hear, again, from the Milwaukee Journal Sentinel that there was a life flight helicopter that was at some point dispatched to the scene. Again, we don't know if that's the helicopter that took these two men to the hospital, but we, again, the, the only confirmed number that we have from the public information officer working with authorities is that two people have been transferred to the hospital, both males, the hospital is in Milwaukee, and one of them is in critical condition right now.